Hi guys and welcome to a new video here on my channel. Ding 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 ding. So in this video we are going to do this intense, super cute but yet like badass look. This is actually a look that I love to wear on an everyday basis. And that might sound weird for you because like dark black lip. But if you know me and have followed me for a while, this is an everyday look for me. And why I love this so much is because with the dark lip and no um, like eyeshadow or anything, it makes you look interesting. I don't know, I feel like it makes you look interesting, yet like, I don't know, just fair. <laughs> if that makes sense. No, it doesn't. With the faux freckles, it kind of softens the look. Um, and um, so, no, oh, lipstick on my teeth. Okay, I'm not gonna keep you guys any longer. If you want to see how I created this look and just chat a little, then just keep on watching. Okay. The first product that we will be using today is the NYX Professional Makeup Honey Do Me Up. This is a primer. It gives really nice luminous skin and it's a really fun formula. It's really like... Like honey. So I'm just gonna rub this in a little bit. And it's really nice if you're a bit dry as well. And for my base and foundation, I'm gonna use the CC Red Correct uh, Perfector from Arborean. I actually love this brand. I started using it uh, this year actually. And I just got this like a few days ago and this is really good I love it I'm not really sure if they have different shades but it matches me perfectly which is not very common but yeah I absolutely love it I'm just gonna use it with a mixed professional makeup a brush okay I'm gonna use a little bit more but with my fingers and blend it out because I think it made it a lot more more it gave it a lot more coverage that's what I'm trying to say <laughs> yeah, so much more coverage when you blend it out with your fingers why do I have glitter everywhere <laughs> For those of you that saw my latest makeup tutorial, you know why I have glitter everywhere. It's in my bed, it's all over my floor, and apparently in my makeup brushes. And now for concealer, I will, as always, I feel like, use the Tarte Shape Tape. This is not the lightest one, because that one, uh, I've run out of it, unfortunately. Uh, but this is the second lightest, I think. So I'm going to conceal and also highlight. And I'm gonna blend it out with a Linda Halberg Cosmetics sponge. It's my favorite sponge at the moment. And now it's time to try out my new method of doing faux freckles. So you need a stippling brush like this that has, let's see if you guys can see this as how it looks. Doesn't really have to be this one, I think. <laughs> um, but I'm gonna use that one and then I'm gonna take the NYX Professional Makeup Total Control Drop Foundation and I'm gonna put this on the brush. I know. <laughs> so I'm gonna shake it. I'm gonna put it on the bristles, just tips like that. And then I'm gonna put it like this. Let's see. And I'm gonna hit the brush. Ooh. All 
All right, now that it looks like I have dots all over my face, I'm just gonna let this sink in and then I'm going to go in with either the brush or the sponge and just soften everything. Okay, let's try it with the sponge. Okay, that seems to work really nice. Let's see, I don't wanna make them too light. I'm just going to lightly pat them in like that and now i'm gonna go in with the stick foundation from anastasia beverly hills in fawn this is a contour stick even though it's called foundation stick for some reason and i'm gonna use this to contour and then just lightly i'm gonna go in with the shade swicky from the linda helberg um Infinity palette and I'm just going to lightly like bronze and also kind of use it as blush because I don't think that I will go in with another blush I think I will just go in with this <gasps> oh my god no I dipped it in this fuck my life <laughs> Oh my god, no. Don't worry, it's just makeup, but fuck. No harm done. I'm just gonna use another brush and be a little bit more careful. And I'm also gonna use this a little bit on the sides of my nose. I don't wanna use that much powder because I want this look to be very luminous, as I said. But I'm gonna go in with a little bit of the loose powder from Paris Berlin and I'm gonna use it just underneath my eyes. Oh, you know what? Just kidding. I'm gonna use it on my lids as well. And then for a new product that I did use in my last makeup tutorial, but I'm so in love with it. It is the new Dream Glow Kit from Anastasia Beverly Hills. Because this look will be kind of simple and just like focus on the lips, I thought I'd why not go in with a fun colored highlight. I think I'm gonna go in with a little bit of Wriggle and Wish. Those speaks to me. Oh, I love this. It's so cute. And I'm gonna use it quite high up here because I want my skin to look very glowy. And now for a first, I'm actually gonna go in with the new 24 hour super brow pomade from Kat Von D. And this is in the shade Aubergine because I thought it could look cool. I am going to apply the liquid lipstick. This is the shade Chimera from uh, Lethal Cosmetics. So I'm going to apply that on my lips though. And I'm going to overline my lips a lot. <laughs> And then for the last product, this is the most amazing gloss, honestly. It's the NYX Professional Makeup Strictly, Strictly Vinyl Lip Gloss in the shade 04 Femme Fatale. I don't know how to pronounce that, but it's the most amazing black gloss. Yum. And then one of my most worn everyday looks is done with a little twist. <laughs> Thank you.
so this is the final look. I am so happy with it and I am so happy I finally made the faux freckles look cute. I hope I won't get comments saying it looks like they're fake. I mean, they are fake, but like, I don't know. I think this is the best job that I've done. And for those of you that have been here for a while, I have struggled. What? <laughs> I can't even say struggled. I struggle saying struggled. Oh. It makes me look a little bit more innocent and like not scary looking. So it's like the perfect mix with the black and the pink highlights. So cute, I love it. <laughs> so if any of you guys recreate this look, um, please tag me on Instagram. I would love to see it. And also if you guys think that this look is super cool, but you feel like mm, I couldn't really do that, please try it. I love the bare eyes and like dark intense lip. It looks really cool, so please, please try it if you haven't already. That was it for me. I won't keep you guys any longer. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Click the bell for notifications because I know that some of you guys are not getting notified when I upload videos and that makes me so angry. <laughs> uh, so yeah, please click the bell if you would like to see my videos. I hope you have an amazing day and I hope we'll see each other in my next video. Bye guys!